Off the coast of Japan something extraordinary sits in the sea. It's a testament to human ingenuity and ambition. It's not a ship, but an airport. Kansai International Airport, a marvel of modern engineering. Kansai International Airport, opened in 1994, was a marvel of engineering. It was built to alleviate congestion at Osaka's existing airport and to showcase Japan's technological prowess. Built on an artificial island, it seemed to defy the laws of nature. Engineers faced numerous challenges from soft seabed to typhoons, but they persevered. This was a statement to the world. Japan, a country short on land but big on ideas, could build anything, anywhere. The airport quickly became a hub of activity, bustling with travelers from all corners of the globe. Millions of travelers passed through its gates, connecting to the world from this improbable location. The airport offered state-of-the-art facilities and seamless connectivity. For a while it seemed like a perfect solution. The airport operated smoothly and its unique location became a point of pride. But the sea, as we know, is a powerful force. Over time the island began to sink, and rising sea levels posed a new threat, and it always has the last word. Engineers continue to battle the elements, reinforcing the island and adapting to the changing environment, but the struggle is ongoing. Constructing Kansai Airport was a monumental task. Engineers faced the daunting challenge of building on the sea. First, they had to create a stable foundation. They did this by sinking massive concrete columns into the seabed. These columns, over a million in total, acted like stilts. On top of these stilts, they built the island itself. It was a carefully layered construction of rock and landfill. This man-made island, strong enough to support the weight of a modern airport, was an incredible feat of engineering. But building on water always comes with risks. Japan, a nation of islands, is densely populated. Space is precious, especially in cities like Osaka, a bustling hub of commerce and culture. Building an airport on land would have meant claiming valuable space. The solution? Look to the sea. A floating airport offered a way to create new land, it would free up space in the city, and it would showcase Japan's technological prowess to the world. It was a bold, ambitious plan, but one that came with a hefty price tag and unforeseen challenges. For years, Kansai Airport operated smoothly, a symbol of human ingenuity, but nature as we know has a way of reminding us who is really in control. The airport designed to float began to sink, slowly at first, almost imperceptibly, but over time the descent became undeniable. The sinking, although anticipated by the engineers, proved to be faster than predicted. Alarm bells started ringing. The very foundation of this engineering marvel was being compromised. The question was no longer if it would sink but how fast and how far. Section 5. Unstable Foundations – The Causes The sinking of Kansai Airport was not entirely unexpected. Engineers knew from the start that the weight of the island would cause some settling. What they didn't fully anticipate was the speed of the sinking. Several factors contributed to this. The soft seabed, the immense weight of the airport, and the constant pressure from the sea itself all played a role. In addition, rising sea levels due to climate change exacerbated the problem. The sinking became a race against time, a constant battle against the forces of nature. Section 6. Can we save our airport? Faced with a sinking airport, Japan refused to give up. Engineers went to work, exploring ways to stabilize the sinking and buy the airport more time. Their solution was as ingenious as the airport itself, pump massive amounts of sand beneath the island to raise it back up. This ongoing process, while expensive, has been successful in slowing the rate of sinking. However, it's not a permanent solution. The fight to keep Kansai Airport afloat is a continuous one, a testament to human resilience and the constant need for innovation. Section 7. Impact on Osaka's Heartbeat the sinking of Kansai Airport has sent ripples of concern throughout Japan, particularly in Osaka. The airport is a vital gateway to the region, handling millions of passengers and tons of cargo each year. Any disruption to its operations impacts businesses, tourism, and the overall economy. The uncertainty surrounding the airport's future has caused concern among investors, airlines, and the local community. The sinking is a stark reminder of the power of nature and the challenges of building even the most ambitious projects in its domain. Section 8. 
Lessons from the Deep. The story of Kansai Airport is a cautionary tale, a reminder that even the most impressive feats of engineering must contend with the forces of nature. It highlights the importance of careful planning, ongoing monitoring, and a healthy respect for the environment. The lessons learned from Kansai are relevant not just for Japan, but for any nation undertaking large-scale infrastructure projects, especially those in coastal areas. It underscores the need to adapt to a changing climate and design for long-term sustainability. Section 9. A Future Adrift? What does the future hold for Kansai Airport? The answer remains uncertain. Engineers continue to monitor the sinking and implement measures to mitigate its effects. The airport for now remains operational, a testament to the ongoing efforts to keep it afloat. However, the long-term viability of the airport remains in question. The sinking coupled with rising sea levels presents a formidable challenge. Difficult decisions may lie ahead involving potential relocation, redesign, or even decommissioning of the airport. Section 10. The Human Spirit of Innovation the story of Kansai Airport, though fraught with challenges, is also a testament to the human spirit of innovation. This airport, built on an artificial island in Osaka Bay, was a bold and ambitious project from the start. Engineers and architects from around the world came together to create something truly remarkable. It demonstrates our ability to dream big, to push the boundaries of what's possible. The construction process was a marvel of modern engineering, involving the use of advanced technology and innovative techniques. The airport's design had to account for the natural challenges of the location, including the risk of earthquakes and typhoons. Even as the airport faces an uncertain future, the lessons learned from its construction and operation will continue to inspire engineers and architects for generations to come. The sinking issues that have plagued the airport since its inception are a constant reminder of the delicate balance between human ambition and the forces of nature. The ongoing battle to keep the airport afloat showcases our resilience, our determination to find solutions even in the face of adversity. Maintenance teams work tirelessly to address the subsidence, employing cutting-edge techniques to stabilize the structure. Their efforts are a testament to the enduring human spirit that refuses to give up. It's a reminder that human ingenuity, while not always capable of conquering nature, can at least strive to coexist with it. Kansai Airport stands as a symbol of what we can achieve when we dare to dream and work together. It is a beacon of hope, showing that with perseverance and innovation, we can overcome even the most daunting challenges. Section 11, a legacy in the balance. Kansai International Airport stands as a symbol of both human ambition and the humbling power of nature. Built on an artificial island in Osaka Bay, it was a marvel of engineering when it opened in 1994. The airport was designed to handle the increasing air traffic in the region and to showcase Japan's technological prowess. Its future hangs in the balance, a constant reminder of the delicate equilibrium we must strike between progress and our environment. The airport faces numerous challenges, from the relentless forces of nature to the ever-present threat of rising sea levels. Engineers and environmentalists work tirelessly to maintain this balance, ensuring that the airport remains operational while minimizing its environmental impact. Whether it continues to operate for years to come or eventually succumbs to the sea, its story will remain a compelling tale of innovation, resilience, and the enduring power of the natural world. The construction of Kansai Airport was a monumental task, involving the reclamation of land from the sea and the creation of a stable foundation on which to build. Today, Ongoing maintenance and innovative solutions are required to combat the natural subsidence of the island and the encroaching waters. The legacy of Kansai Airport will depend on the choices we make today. As we face the realities of climate change and environmental degradation, the airport serves as a case study in the importance of sustainable development. Engineers and scientists are exploring new technologies and methods to protect the airport and its surroundings, from advanced seawalls to eco-friendly construction materials. It serves as a powerful reminder of our responsibility to build sustainably, to respect the limits of our environment, and to adapt to the challenges of a changing world. Kansai International Airport is more than just a transportation hub. It is a testament to human ingenuity and the ongoing struggle to coexist with nature. As we look to the future, the lessons learned from Kansai will be crucial in guiding our efforts to create a more sustainable and resilient world.